Hello everyone and welcome to episode one of nine in nine with Southampton. Today we travel to Bristol City in the opening game of my tenure in charge of the Saints. Can we rise up the table and reach the promised land that is the Premier League? Don't forget if you enjoyed this content to please leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already, don't forget to click that notification bell to know when a new video goes up on the channel and also don't forget to leave me a comment if you've got anything to say. Before we go into the game, let's take a look at the data hub shall we? Because I think it explains why Southampton are where they are. So the goals per game, nothing wrong with that, 1.62 expected 1.56 it's the goals conceded where we are falling down massively nearly two goals a game we're conceding and we are expected to concede just over one and a half a game shots per game that's not great either shots on target it could be better but it's better than the average of the championship pass completion rate 85 percent you'd expect that to be a little bit higher than that the tackles won is another one that we're not really good at but we have put it on to get stuck in so hopefully they will do we need to sort out the defense though that's why we've gone with the kind of the five at the back system today to give us a bit more stability back there we're in sort of quiet defense leaky defense but nearly sort of busy defense leaky defense so we're on the periphery of the two axes so yeah we definitely need to do it let's take a look at the league table and see where we are so here is the championship table. So Ipswich Town lead the way at the top. Four points clear of West Ham, who are up in second. Crystal Palace have a game in hand. They're third on 32. Then come Watford, have 31. Bournemouth and Blackburn have got 28 apiece. Reading have got 27. Bristol City today's opponents are on 25. They're just outside the playoffs at this point. Stoke and Barnsley have got 24 apiece. Coventry, there they are. Our old side on 22 with Luton completing the top half down at the bottom. Where the road back for us starts today. We have the chance to move up into 16th provided results go our way if we can pick up a win. But Wigan are bottom of the table on 10. Middlesbrough got 12 as have Birmingham City. There's QPR on 13. Portsmouth have got 14. Swansea 16. There's us on 17. Derby on 18. Cardiff on 20. Preston Hull and Huddersfield completing the bottom half with 21. So as I say, the long road to the Premier League starts here. Let's go to Ashton Gate. Let's have a look at the teams. So here are the two starting lineups for this one. Bristol City start with Fodring and Goal, Drama, Vinya, Moore, McQueen, Faiskinson, Williams, Semenyo, Scott, Wheeler with Kremich leading the line. We start with Forster in Goal, Livramento, Dyer. Holding, Williams, Lewis, Romeu, Ward-Prowse, Promise, Torres, with Adam Armstrong leading the line. So my tenure at Southampton begins at Bristol City. Will it end with promotion to the Premier League? It's a long road to go, but we are on the journey. Let's see if we can do it. Starts with today. Got to pick up at least a point from this one. Bristol City are closing in on those playoff places, but if we want the ambition to be there ourselves, we need to beat teams like this, or at least not lose to them. It's done really well since Hansi Flick's been gone. I'm just looking to keep that going. Corner to Bristol City. First highlight. Not a great one. Semenyo with it. Will we head it away? We will. Eric Dyer heads it clear. Hayskinson going back in towards Semenyo. You've got to get out there. Ball into the centre. Holding heads it clear. Williams tries to pick it up. We are all over the place by the looks of it. Vigna plays it into Kremerich. Semenyo trying to go around the outside. Ball over towards the far post. Livermento heads it clear. And it's still with Bristol City. McQueen. Goes back into Moore. On towards Baskinson. Vigna into Williams. Kremerich going wide. Lewis heads it forward towards Torres. We finally picked up the ball. Looking for Armstrong down the centre. That's a great ball in behind. Gets the shot away and it's gone into the bottom corner. Goodness me. We were completely backs against the wall. Adam Armstrong has a goal though. Wow. That's a turn round, isn't it? Just pick it up in midfield. Long ball over the top. In behind the back two. Adam Armstrong takes it early. Catches the goalkeeper out. He tries to catch it. 
goes completely to the wrong side though. Bristol City nil, Southampton one. Coventry are losing at home to Hull. It's a surprise. It's the 17th we are at the moment. Eric Dyer with a good tackle. Scott trying to come down the field. Romeo comes back, but he gives it straight back to him. Scott again. Got to stop the cross if we can. Ball towards the far post. Wheeler will head it back across goal. Kremerich with a shot. Holding will head it clear. Ward Prowse will pick it up calmly. Calmly. Unlike me. And that first half has flown by. Good stuff. One shot on target, one goal. Take that. If we can continue that rate for the rest of the season, I will be very, very happy. Can we hang on to it in the second half? Let's hope so. To get us underway in the second half. Back three doing its job at the moment. We had a couple of scares. Nothing major yet, though. Lewis with the ball down the left-hand side. Good tackle from Semenyo. Lewis with the throw. Throws in towards Prowse. Ward Prowse gets the ball over. Williams with a shot on the volley. Goodness me. That's confidence. Semenyo with the throw. Throws it in towards Drama. Semenyo again. Going around the outside again. Can we block the cross? We can't. Kramerich is underneath his own bar. And it's 1-1. Mm, okay. Not much we can do about that. Maybe Fraser Forster should do better. Digs the cross out from a very awkward position. But he should be stopped there. That's when you've got to stop the cross right at the point of contact. Yeah, easy header. Not much the goalkeeper could do about it. 1-1. Get a bit of encouragement on the field. Williams with the throw. Throws it into Promise. Got plenty of space. Back into Williams. Get the ball into the area. Plays it towards the far post. Ward Prowse! There we go. Straight back in front. Lovely from James Ward Prowse. Leading by example. Bristol City 1, Southampton 2. It's an easy cross into the box, isn't it? Talk about no pressure on the ball. Williams is allowed the time to pick someone out. Ward Prowse with his head. Not known for that. 2-1. And the encouragement has come far too late. Oh dear. All right, let's have a look at the substitution. Greenwood's on for Semenyo. Good. Semenyo was having a good game for him. So Quincy Promise is going to be the man to come off. And your potent is going to come off. Podence or Podence? Podence, isn't it? Corner kick. Chance for Bristol City to get back level. Williams with it. Ball into the area. Moore hits it towards goal. It's over the bar. Ooh. A free jump at it. Free kick. Moore inside to Bakinson. Kramerich into Scott. Accepted by Williams. Back to Forster. Holding. Got a turn. No. This is me. Back here with it to Dyer. There's confidence and there's confidence. And I'm not that confident in you at the moment. Wheeler looking in behind for Kremerich. Kremerich with a shot and it's a good turn away from the goalkeeper. Liveramento will bring it down the field. And they survive just about. Going to make a change at the back. Or at least in midfield. Romeo is on a yellow card. Let's get him off the field. Will Smallbone is going to come on. Williams with the throw. Third goal would be fantastic. Potence into Ward Prowse. Smallbone tries to get the shot away. Plays it towards Lewis. Low and hard. Shoot! No! Armstrong hits it away. Vina will complete the clearance. Sully Kaiko has pulled a goal back for Coventry. We'll still keep an eye on him, don't worry. Into the last few minutes, Lewis with the throw. In towards Smallbone. Lewis again. He'll find a cross into the centre. He will. Holding gets up and he heads it over the bar. That's the good thing about the five at the back system. Rob Holding would not normally find himself in a penalty area like that. Into the last few minutes. Can we see this out? Got to stop the cross. Vina with it. Corner to Bristol City. Hang on to your hats. Going to be a bumpy ride, I think. For the last few, we might make a substitution just to waste a bit of time. Low road towards Courtney Hawes. Back into the corner taker, Williams. Over everybody's head. Is it going to roll out? No. Remember, she's going to be the first man to it. Balls again. Baskinson. Scott. Remember, Playing it across. We've got to get rid. Get rid. There we go. Poden picks it up. Warcraft goes back into Dyer and just calms everything down. Let us make a change. Torres is going to be the man to come off. We're going to bring on Stuart Armstrong. Get a bit of encouragement on the field. Come on. Holding with the throw into Smallbone. Lewis. Back into Holding. Cross in towards Prowse, but he's lost the ball. James Ward Prowse. Got to try and win it back. Peterson. Someone's got to try and close him down. Forster's going to get there first and just take your time. Got 30 seconds. It'll be a massive win and a great way to start our tenure. His potence has got the ball on the left-hand side. 
got Armstrong coming in at the far post. Armstrong coming in at the centre as well. The two Armstrongs in there together. Get to the corner flag. Williams goes for the shot and it will roll behind for a corner. We are just about going to have enough time to take it. Then called Prowse with the ball into the area. Can we get a head on it? Stuart Armstrong tries to head it in and it's put wide at the far post by Adam Armstrong. But he's offside anyway. But that will be it for today. Fodringham's going to take the goal kick, send it down the field, and hopefully the referee is going to blow his full time whistle. He hasn't yet. Maybe now. Armstrong. There it is. Full time. Bristol City 1, Southampton 2. We are off to a winning start. Although Bristol City will count themselves unlucky, I should imagine. We replied pretty quickly when they did equalise. Let's take a look at the league table. So it doesn't do much for our league position. It does move us up one place and nearly into positive goal difference as well. Eight points away from the bottom three. Ten points away from the top six. That's the margins we are dealing in at this moment. We are very much in no man's land. But we've got plenty of games left in the season. Let's see where we're going to come back next time. So what we will do is we will take on Reading, we'll take on Huddersfield, we'll take on Swansea, we'll take on QPR. We will come back for what I'm coining the Alan Shearer Derby as Southampton take on Blackburn. And that should be a cracker. Hopefully we can keep things up in between. Obviously a great start to our tenure today. It was a bit sketchy at times, but we got the result in the end. And that is five wins from six since Hansi Flick has been gone from the football club. The players are doing tremendously well. Obviously, as I mentioned, eight points gap to the bottom three, 10 points gap to the top six at the moment. We're gonna slowly start to reel them in. Obviously, Reading next up, who jumped into the top six this weekend. A couple of easier games along the way before we come back for the Alan Shearer derby against Blackburn Rovers. Don't forget, if you enjoyed today's video, to please leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And also, don't forget to leave me a comment if you've got anything to say on today's video. And I will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.